Hey guys, it's Arika Misha, and the kitchen getting ready to cook it up real nice and quick. Today, y'all already know, we love Bartoli. So today, I will be cooking, now I haven't cooked this on my channel. Today, I'll be cooking a Bartoli family size chicken broccoli fettuccine alfredo. Yes. Let's see what they got in here, y'all. Okay, so fettuccine with grilled white chicken and broccoli in a rich and creamy alfredo sauce. Ooh, that sounds good to me. And I got some Publix garlic bread sticks. This is my little new bread stick that I really like. Publix bread sticks. These are, these are really good, y'all. Make sure you all check them out. Look, nice, cute, quick meal, y'all, for the family. Y'all already know I'm going to cook it up real quick. This is going to be a quick video. So quick, you're going to want to go out and buy it and make it. I need to talk to Bertoli about sponsoring me. I'm always cooking their food on my channel, y'all. But anyway, all right. Let's get into this meal. Okay guys, we're ready to drop our family size chicken, broccoli, fettuccine, and alfredo in our uh, oil. I did two tablespoons of the Bertoli oil. <laughs> Only goes right, we cooking Bertoli. But anyway, I always keep some oil on hand. We're gonna go ahead and dump that in. Okay, that's looking real cute. Okay. Uh-oh, uh-oh, wait now, stay in the pan. Everybody stay in the pan now. Ain't nobody dropping no groceries. Uh-uh, baby. We ain't dropping no groceries. Okay, okay. That's our garlic bread in the oven. I threw that in the oven. That was done. 375 degrees for the garlic bread. Seven to nine minutes. Mine's take seven minutes. Okay, so let's move this patoli oil out of the way. Let me clean my stove off because y'all already know I'm OCD. I do not like anything dirty, especially a dirty stove. Okay. Let me get that cleaned up. And as y'all can see, we got to cook it up. One thing I like about these Bertoli meals, it don't take them long to cook. These Bertoli meals take 7 to 10 minutes to cook. 7 to 10 minutes. I'm going to take y'all in so y'all can get a good idea of how everything looks. Alright, let me zoom y'all in a little bit more. Okay. Yep, that's it. As y'all can see, we have our noodles. This is how they come. You know, like in a frozen noodle shape. Like a little noodle ball. We got our broccoli. Golly. These broccoli are looking like trees, man. Come on now. And we have our sauce. That's going to melt down. That's the sauce. That's going to melt down. Let's see if we can find some chicken. Come on, Bertoli. Come through with the chicken now. He got... See, that's what I be saying about Bartoli. That's the only thing. Y'all know I keep it real. That's the only down thing with Bartoli. They don't put enough meat in there for me. Now, I like a lot of meat. Please don't give me all these noodles. I do not like a bowl full of noodles. I need some meat with my noodles. I'm just keeping it real. Uh-uh. Don't be giving me all doggone noodles and no meat. Anyway. All right. So, I'm going to cover this. And all you're doing is letting it simmer down. See if I can get my top on this. Hold on, y'all. Wash my top off real quick. See if we can. Uh oh. Drop in my spoon. All right. Okay. Let's see if we can get our top on. A little fat over here. Let's see. Oh, okay. What? Well, it's not quite going down all the way. But once everything melt down. Okay, good. We got our top down. Alright, so you all know, y'all see how I got y'all zoomed in. It is a beautiful meal. Uh I love the Bertoli meals. Y'all know I always talk about Bertoli. I love their meals. Quick and easy. Uh the only thing with Bertoli, uh y'all know I tell y'all true, keep it real. They don't add enough meat for me. Some people like the pasta and a little bit of meat. I'm just saying for me, it's for me and my house. <laughs> That's for me and my house. We want some extra meat with these noodles. You know, we like a lot of meat with the pasta. We don't like all pasta and no meat. We like a lot of meat and a little bit of pasta. So, usually, like if I get something Bertoli that's like a chicken Bertoli, I usually buy chicken and just add chicken to it. But, um, I didn't do that today. So, but anyway. Um, yep. So, and also the Bertoli meals, they can be a little bland. Most frozen meals are like that. So, I just add my little seasons. Now, while this is cooking down, I'm going to go ahead and do that. I'm going to go ahead and add my seasonings. I'm doing a little garlic pepper. 
and I'm adding my seasonings now while everything's cooking together, you know? So, a little garlic pepper. I'm doing a little regular salt. Doing some brown salt. Okay. I'm gonna do a little season, a little Morton seasoning. All around season, I'm gonna add a little bit of that. Okay, we is doing it. Okay. All right, and of course I'm gonna add parsley. We've got our broccoli. Whoa, whoa. We've got our broccoli, but I'm adding a little parsley to give it a little bit more green. All right, got our parsley in there. Still cleaned off. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and cover it back up. I'm going to give it another quick stir before I close it back up. Just stir this around. Get those noodles down there to the bottom. So those noodles can get themselves all loosened up down there. These doggone broccolis, man. I'm telling you. These broccolis are huge. They like little mini trees. Lord have mercy. We ain't big on greens. I just got to keep it real. We are not big on greens. But we do take vitamin supplements to supplement for the green that we do not intake. So, you know, to make sure we stay healthy, make sure the girls stay healthy, we take our vitamins every day, all that good stuff. Definitely, I mean, if you know, we're not big green eaters, like I said, so we make sure we supplement, you know, everything. Y'all know how that go. Supplement. All right. Some people just not big on greens. That's, so what? All right. So. All right, looking good. We got a couple more sauces that need to melt down. Got a little bit more noodles that need to break up and melt down. And these doggone broccolis. Oh, my Lord. All right. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and cover it because it needs to be covered. Definitely need to be covered so you're heating. Uh, everything stays, you know, the heat helps cook everything down for you. So, ooh, let me pull my garlic bread out the oven. Lord Jesus. Okay, garlic bread. Garlic bread, don't be trying to burn on the camera because I'm still going to have to show the people to burn garlic bread. Come on now, garlic bread. Don't do that. I forgot about it in the oven. The time went off. But it looked good, y'all. It ain't burnt. It ain't burnt. Looks good. Nice brown. Ooh, I smell like garlic. feel like I'm in Italy, y'all. Yes, I do. In Italy. <sighs> yes. Okay. All right, y'all. So, I'm going to bring y'all back. Y'all know I'm going to bring y'all back for the grand finale. This is quick and easy, y'all. This is a quick video. Because Batoli meals, they quick and easy. That's why I like them. I mean, they taste good, too. So, I'm keeping it real with that, too. So, all right, y'all. I'm going to bring it back. Uh, show y'all. But let me give y'all this word of the day. Y'all know I always got a word in my spirit. Something that God's always dealing with me. So, I'm going to tell y'all what God's been dealing with me. And I pray that it may help somebody. Y'all know. Y'all know how I do. Like, like, things that I'm dealing with spiritually, things that, you know, I just pray that it helps someone. You know, just telling y'all what I'm dealing with. So, uh, something that God has been dealing with me about is trust. Having faith and trusting God to do it. Like, I know a lot of times we say we have faith. Oh, God, I trust you. God, have faith. But I'm telling y'all, I'm telling y'all, God has been dealing with me on my faith. I've been dealing with some spiritual things. You know, and I, and I honestly, y'all, I'm just keeping it real. Y'all have to trust and believe that God going to do it for me. I got to trust and believe that God going to do it for me. Just keeping it real with y'all. I said, God, you know, I'm keeping it real. Y'all, this is this. I say, I said, God, I said, God, this look a little impossible. And God said, I am the God of impossible. If I can't do it, it can't be done. So, so what you talking about, girl? What you talking about? If I can't do it, it can't be done. We all, we know God can do all things. God said, don't worry about it. You just trust and have faith in me. You do your part. I'm going to do my part. God said, you do your part. I'm going to do my part. Don't worry about nothing else. Don't worry about me. I got mine. God said, you ain't got to worry about me because I'm going to do my part. Just do your part. So, got to trust God, y'all. We got to trust God even when it looks ugly and impossible. Just do your part. Do your part. Do what you're supposed to do. And God handle it. Don't worry about it. That's what God been dealing with me on, y'all. So, trust God. Have faith. Trust God. He, he going to do it for you. All right, y'all. I'll be back with the grand finale. Okay, guys, we are at the grand finale. I'm getting ready to cut the stove off. Let me go ahead and do that. 
our meal is done it's nice and simmered down and of course yes I did taste it yes it is my food y'all know what I tell y'all it's my food I bought it with my hard earned working money I can do whatever I want to anyway <coughs> excuse me you know sometimes you just gotta put people in their place don't make me do another word of the day anyway <laughs> oh y'all know I'm crazy I be tripping myself out the stuff I be saying but anyway, y'all know I love the Lord, but I am a little cray-cray. All right, let's get back to the meal. Our chicken broccoli batole meal. Yes, it's amazing. It tastes good. Like I told y'all meantime, I ain't gonna keep saying I love batole meals. I love the meals. They're quick and easy meals. Yep, I need to holler at batole. I'm gonna have to email them about a sponsorship because anyway. All right, y'all. Y'all see, it's done. Let me take y'all in. Ooh, look at it. Well, I done gave y'all that word of the day. Y'all seen me do it. Y'all know I did it. And uh, yeah, y'all seen me do it. Y'all know I did it. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha. And don't forget, guys, that knowledge is power. Thanks, guys. Bye.